we've tested over 50 robot vacuums, and below are our recommendations for the best robot vacuum cleaners you can buy. These picks are selected not only based on their performance, but also their feature set, design, and price. For more recommendations, look at our list of the best vacuums, the best vacuums for high pile carpet, and the best vacuums for pet hair. In this video we will look at some of the best robot vacuums on the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description box below. Number 1. Roborock Q5 Robot Vacuum The Roborock Q5 is the best robot vacuum cleaner at a mid-range price we've tested. While you're missing out on the real-time hazard identification system found on the Roborock S7 Max Fund EcoVax Bot Osmo T8 AV, this relatively affordable vacuum offers good value for money. It is a LiDAR mapping system that maps out rooms quickly compared to most optical sensor-based systems, especially in dimly lit rooms. Its companion app is very easy to use and lets you set up virtual boundary lines that it won't cross or direct it to clean a specific room in your home. It delivers exceptional performance on bare surfaces like hardwood or tile floors and is remarkably effective when dealing with pet hair though it struggles a little on carpet. The Q5 Plus variant comes bundled with a self-emptying station, though this configuration is considerably more expensive than the base variant. Unfortunately, despite having a high-efficiency E11 filter, it does a terrible job of sealing in fine particles, which are blown free from its lidar sensor. If you have allergies, the Wise Robot Vacuum is a better option. It features LiDAR navigation and does a much better job of sealing in allergens like pet dander. However, it has a shorter battery life and a slightly less feature-packed companion app. Unlike the basic Q5, the Wise isn't compatible with a self-emptying base station. Number 2. Nito D8 Storing Picture Robot Vacuum For those looking to spend as little as possible, the Nito D8 is the best robot vacuum at a budget price we've tested. It has a much shorter max battery life of 70 minutes than the Roborock Q5, so it'll probably need to return to its base station to recharge when cleaning larger areas. It isn't compatible with the self-emptying base station, which would help reduce hands-on maintenance requirements. That said, it still offers quick and precise LiDAR mapping at a much more affordable price than the Roborock. This allows you to set up virtual boundary lines for areas you don't want the vacuum to enter. Unfortunately, its squared-off front end is liable to get caught on furniture. Performance on flat, even surfaces is superb, and it does an alright job of handling debris on carpeted surfaces though it'll probably need to make an extra pass to collect everything. It's also capable of automatically adjusting its suction power depending on the surface it's on, which is a rare but welcome feature at this price point. Number 3 iRobot Room the S9 Plus Robot Vacuum If you suffer from allergies but still want a robot vacuum to handle your light duty cleaning needs, the iRobot Roomba S9 is among the robot vacuums we've tested. Compared to the Roborock S7 Max, it has a much simpler optical sensor-based system with no LiDAR mapping and no real-time hazard identification and avoidance capability. It also doesn't have a mopping attachment, so you'll need to look elsewhere for a robot vacuum that can handle stains. It has an onboard HEPA filter which is highly effective in trapping particles like pet dander. The S9 Plus variant comes with a self-emptying dock that can suck debris from its internal dustbin into an external dirt bag without manual intervention, so you don't have to worry about creating a cloud of dust and debris when emptying it. If you don't mind giving up the onboard HEPA filter, the Yidivac station offers self-emptying capability at a much lower purchase price. The Yidi also has a passive mopping system, though it isn't especially effective in clearing stains. Number 4. Dream Dash D10 Plus Robot Vacuum I'll admit that I was initially skeptical of the DreamBot D10 Plus. At a retail price of $400, it offers features like a self-emptying dustbin and a built-in mopping pad while costing hundreds less than comparably equipped cleaners. Turns out, no. Though it wasn't the best at any of the skills in our slate of tests, it was powerful and versatile enough to keep up with the competition at just about every turn. It's right on par with the top robot vacuums we test on low-pile and mid-pile carpets, 
and it outperformed every other cleaner on hardwood floors except for the $1,100 Roomba Combo J7 Plus. Its LiDAR, laser-rated navigation was sharp and consistent, and right on par with what we'd expect from other top brands that put that technique to work, including Nito and Roborock. With built-in Wi-Fi, it supports voice-activated cleaning via Alexa or the Google Assistant. I also appreciated that the self-emptying dock holds up to 2.5 liters of dust and debris, good enough for 45 days of uninterrupted cleaning. Dream Tech says, while still being less bulky, and less ugly, than some other tank-like self-emptying cleaners. Number 5. Rubber Rock S7 Robot Vacuum. With a competitive price plus rock-solid performance and intelligent navigation, the Rubber Rock S7 is a clear top pick among mid-range robot vacuums. It's our overall top-rated cleaner on low-pile carpet, and it boasts competitive averages on hardwood floors and mid-pile carpet, too. On top of that, it features a built-in mopping pad, which is great to have on hand in the kitchen. It isn't inexpensive at $650, but it's regularly on sale, including right now, where you can knock a whopping $240 off of the price via Amazon coupon. Aided by multiple sensors and lasers, efficient navigation is the S7's other strong suit. The vacuum cleaner covered the entire floor of our test room without missing any spots across multiple runs in an average of just 16 minutes. That's a full 9 minutes shorter than the room the S9 Plus required for the same job. The lack of a self-emptying bin is a bit of a bummer here, but you've got other good options if that's what matters most. And you can always step up to the Roborock S7 Plus, which adds it in. Apart from that, there's not much that you're missing here making this an excellent mid-range pick, especially for homes with an abundance of area rugs and other low-pile carpets. No other cleaner we've tested cleans carpets like those better than the S7. Read our Oberock S7 Robot Vacuum Review.